It's been a very intense three days. I think that um, it's my first time at Stereopsia and I'm uh, kind of I'm very happy to be in the heart of Europe because I feel that it's it's been a very different experience for me connecting with so many European players and, and, and uh, partners but also diving into both research and policy making because I do believe that other events are concentrating either on content side or just on the innovation and the technology and there is a broader infrastructure that needs to be built right now around this industry and I do believe that Stereopsy is doing a great job covering those essential parts uh, that would require this industry to grow. So the panel that uh, we just had um, was uh, maybe a summary of uh, the event and a little bit of advice for the industry uh, participants and the audience to take from the event. Um, I think that I expressed my own advice to just um, get yourself into the headset because my feeling and I've been working in this industry for almost 10 years now but uh, specifically within the last three years I'm concentrating on social engagement inside the virtual worlds inside the metaverse and I really want more people to get exposed to the opportunities that are not going to be there tomorrow that are not going to be somewhere in the distant future but they're already available for all of us today to explore and I uh, wanted to advise that uh, participants and uh, members of the audience really try to educate themselves and also put on the headset because it requires your brain some time to adjust. So it is important that in the future everyone feels comfortable inside the social uh, kind of virtual environment and we need just people spending a bit more time inside the headset to get to this level of comfort.